Well, we just want to say thank you guys for coming out this morning. I believe every time you come to the house of God, you'll be blessed. I believe every time you give your time to the Lord and the house of God to come and fellowship. And I believe that what happens is that you get built up. You know, we go through our week and we go through things in life that just drain, you know, peace and joy we go through life sometimes life is not easy struggles a work a family and sometimes when we come you know saturday and when sunday morning comes in sometimes we feel weak and sometimes we like man i just don't want to go to church but but i believe that when you choose to come to church you come here you hear the word of god you worship you fellowship with god's people and i believe that charges you up for the whole week amen amen well we have a father's day today amen and we are blessed people because we have a father who loves us amen but you know i i read some statistics this morning and you know this our culture and our country we are fatherless generation amen check this. i i saw some statistics it just blew my mind i want to read some did you know that 43 percent children in u.s live without fathers the 90 percent of homeless and runaway kids are come from fatherless generation that 71 percent of high school dropouts are come from fatherless generation the 63 percent of kids that commit suicide come from fatherless homes you know that's a that's just a reality check that we live in society that does not have father you know who raises kids nowadays it's a tv it's mtv it's a the rap crap uh you know that stuff that kids just listen you know and we sometimes turn the tv on and we see kids shot somebody kids went to the school shot you know we get sometimes amazed that these things happens but if a kids all they sit is just watch tv and play video games trust me it's not a shocker for nobody that we see all these things happen today you know fatherless generate fatherless produces poverty hate anger and that's what happens in our society today you know but thank god that we are christians you know it doesn't matter if you sit at this uh, on here today and you maybe you have a good father maybe you don't have a good father the truth is that we don't come from our father we come through our father from our father above amen so if you sit today and maybe you had a good father praise god you know you were blessed you had somebody who took care of you who showed you how to do things but if you sit in this place and you know and statistics says you know the half of us don't have a father's you know maybe your dad was abusive maybe he was a drag addict or alcoholic but you have a good news you have a father above there's three types of fathers there's a our natural fathers there's a spiritual father are the pastors mentors and leaders there's also the third father is our heavenly father and that's the most important thing that you today maybe in this place and you don't have a father that you have a spiritual father is the pastors and leaders and that's why we so believe in home groups that because we have a generation today who does not have fathers and these leaders and mentors that we have today they're like fathers they teach us they show us the way of the lord amen you know you know i just also read the statistic that you know about stalin and hitler that those two people did not have fathers they died in their early age and that kind of effect had on the history those two men uh, such a negative effect i believe that we can be also a positive effect if we have a godly man godly fathers that will raise up godly children and they will have a godly effect on this world amen they, they had these two brothers one was super successful lawyer and was one was just so so like a poor living on the bridge and they took an interview both of them and asked them you know how come one brother ended up here and the other one ended up there you know and the poor uh guy says well you know i never had a dad he all, when he was there he was also abusive always drunk always hit me and they interviewed the other guy and he's like well how come you made it he's like it's because of my father my heavenly father he's like i know when things got rough in my life my dad wasn't here i can always come to my heavenly father and he said that every the bible says every good and perfect gift comes from father above and when our humanly and naturally fathers fail our god will never fail amen so i want right now us to pray for two things i want us to bless the fathers that we have in our church in our lives but second thing i want us to pray is for the 
people that do not have fathers for the fatherless generation that God will show them the true father from the heaven that they have somebody they can go through 24 7 when their heavenly father's not there amen